Welcome to another exciting episode of SEO Plus AI with Josh Brzezinski. This is a quickie video I'm doing for you to show you the new browsing alpha uh, that uh, ChatGPT is doing. They've made a search agent that can actually search the web like Bing Chat does. And they're going to take on Google with this and they're going to take on Bing with this. So these are very exciting times. Uh, let's check it out. Okay, so as you can see here, this is the new browsing alpha that they have. Uh, this is actually gonna let you browse the web and I'll show you how it works in a second. So what can you do with it? Well, you could do anything with this. The only limit is your imagination. So uh, I decided I'd do something that's SEO specific, but this could be applied to anything you're doing. And I said, find me good SEO clients. And it says, as an AI language model, I can't find clients for you directly, uh, but I can offer you some tips on how to find clients. You can do those stuff. I said, yeah, 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 whatever. I said, okay, fine. What segments, verticals, or markets usually buy SEO services? And it gave me the segments that buy SEO services. There's e-commerce, there's local business, there's healthcare, there's professional services, there's real estate, there's travel and hospitality. I said, okay, please list some websites and specific businesses in these verticals that make good money. So I said, sure, I did all that. It did all these searches for me, started clicking on different pages and to get me information, it, it froze. So I said, please keep going, you can do it. <laughs> and so then it finished the browsing and it said, here are some examples of businesses in each of the metric verticals that have been successful. And it actually gave me actual businesses I can now contact to see if they want SEO services that are actually making money that often hire SEO services. And I can go here and I can click on the link and boom, I can see, I can cite my sources and I can see, oh look, it actually found some actual pages that uh, actually have information on them that's true information or as true as this page is anyway. True information of actual businesses here I can go to and actually uh, see here's this page they got here and I can actually see where they got the information from. There's healthcare, there's professional services. And I said, great, okay, okay, great. Please give me the exact email address to contact each of these companies, specifically whomever might be the decision maker on marketing initiatives for them. That's who I wanna talk about for SEO packages, of course, the decision maker, their marketing manager, their, their, their chief marketing officer, whatever it is. And I said, feeling that, please list these pages, contact pages. So it says, it's an AI language model, I'm not allowed, blah, 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 then it froze again. And I said, to what? It says, I'm not allowed to reach out to them. Here are the contact pages for some of the companies mentioned. And boom, it gives me all of the contact pages right here in ChatGPT. All I need to do is just click on these now and go to their contact page and they actually find someone that I can uh, talk to. It's not gonna work perfectly for every single one, but in three seconds, I was able to find uh, 15 different companies that I should be approaching to sell them my SEO services. I could have also very easily set up here, find me the businesses that buy links, right? I could have said, which segments, verticals, or markets usually buy SEO services in terms of links. And I can also contact these guys to see if they need any link services or article writing services that of course I would do with ChatGPT. So it just took me a couple seconds to find this information. I asked for their LinkedIn. It didn't allow me to do that, but that's fine. Uh, there's ways, different ways you can you can ask it different questions. And I, so I thought this was really cool, a uh, quick way of showing you the kind of the power that the browsing alpha has. This is not open to the general public at this time of me filming this. Uh, uh, technically, I'm not supposed to show anyone this. So by the time I show you this, it might already be out. But uh, this is uh, the, where uh, ChatGPT is going. Uh, and uh, they're definitely going to be competing with Google. So that's super exciting information. They're definitely going to be competing with Google. They might not be making a search engine, but they're making a search agent. And the search agent will do normal searches on Bing, will do normal searches on Google, and will be able to bring the information to you that you want to get there. So if you've got a beer, drink them, because things are going to get uh, crazy in a second when OpenAI decides to take on Google doing these kind of searches. So I thought that was a really cool little trick to showing you how you can get SEO services and see you could contact right away or link uh, building right away. So drink them if you got them. Good luck in the SERPs and make sure you, you like and subscribe my channel. Make sure you click the bell so you get new videos. Whenever I see any cool new tricks in, in AI, I'll be making multiple videos every week showing you how to get the best out of SEO and AI. Cheers.